Hey guys, sorry about that. My uh, my battery died on me, so I had to take it inside and charge it up for a bit. But anyways, yeah, I was uh, last thing I think I was talking about was uh, this little pack here. I keep shoelaces and uh, a few little odds and ends, and some zip ties and uh, some block and stuff in here. So it's a nice little pouch. It's also got a little pocket at the front. So there's nothing too fancy. As well as I keep. Uh, my uh, first aid kit in here, my by uh, my Maxpedition FR1 medical pouch by Maxpedition or whatever. I like that. I said Maxpedition twice. <laughs> but uh, yeah, and the paracord, 50 feet again. Uh, I'm actually uh, getting some more paracord, multicolored paracord for uh, doing some paracord bracelets soon. So uh, just uh, keep tuned, tuned in, and uh, I'll might do a video on how to make them. Uh, a buddy of mine uh, from England. Uh, from Brussels there he uh, I'll link him down below he showed me a video and he's also uh, got a lot of awesome videos on his knife collection he's actually got the uh, the book of Eli blade from uh, the movie the blade that Eli carries around it's uh, sick I'll have to show you that in his video anyways back to the bag uh, in the front here I just keep uh, you know some has a few little uh, uh, lined paper and then my pad another pad of paper here for doodling and whatnot so and as you can see that inside of this uh, pouch pocket here of this backpack is massive. It actually opens up and folds right open so you have no problem accessing anything you need to access. So I'll zip that up now, All right? All right. It's a lot lighter so it just bounces around now. But uh, yeah, it's a decent back. I think I weighed it, weighed it in with all this stuff in it and the axe around just a uh, just a hair under 20 pounds so which is not too bad for carrying so it's also got a really good uh, stiff handle grip here so you can hold on to all right and uh, it's got these it's got great uh, shoulder straps with uh, molly attachments and loops and an elastic band here and a uh, little uh, d-ring d here uh, it's great it's got a uh, a chest, a chest strap for across your chest, and also it's got a waist strap here, which I just got uh, rubber banded uh, together because uh, I'm not using them right now, so I'm not carrying usually too much, so I don't use this as much. So, as well as it has here, it has a water bladder uh, area to put in a camel pack, right? You open that up, and you can fit a little water bladder in there. I just right now have my the dogs, another one of my dogs' bowls in here for him, right? Which is uh, awesome. I think you can fit up to a hundred ounce water bladder inside of it, which is a uh, fair size. And that'll keep you going for a while on a hike. As well as it has a little uh, pocket here where you can run the the drinking tube out of, right? And you can run it out and then close this uh, back up, right? And then run it down the straps uh, through the through the molly uh, molly attachments and whatnot through the D ring and stuff. And then it's right on here, so it's not flopping around on you. All right, and then uh, yeah, it's a awesome backpack. Uh, no complaints at all. I love it. So and then on this side here, I just have a, uh, a little case. I believe this is a, a grenade case. Actually, I picked it up from the army surplus. This one's a brand new one. They sell some new stuff there as well. So and I just keep my compass, my knife sharpener, a few small knives, a lighter, and a pair of toe clippers in there as well. I have my little Gerber little Gerber knife in here right and whatnot so it's uh it's awesome so yeah anyways uh thanks for uh watching my uh video sorry about it, having to break it down the two parts there but it only does 10 minutes at a time on this little camera so and that's my review on the Falcon uh, 2 by Max Petition this is a uh, yeah great pack and uh yeah I can't I can't complain at all so uh if you guys are interested in a decent hiking pack, a little one to two day pack, uh, I would definitely suggest uh, this company. And uh, yeah, and uh, yeah, su subscribe for more videos if you guys are interested in my channel and like what I'm doing. And uh, leave some comments if you think there's other stuff I can add. I know I don't have any food or anything like that in that in here, and I don't have a tarp and whatnot, but I, I'll put that in usually the, when I go camping as well. And oh yeah, there's one more quick thing I figured I should show you while, while I'm here on the bottom of this. It has a rubberized pad for sitting on the ground, which is great. And it also has these these loops here, which you can expand out and actually hold on to a, a tent 
a small like three person tent and a tarp and probably a, a, a ground mat for you to sleep on, sleeping mat. So, which is awesome. Uh, let's see, you can attach anything to this backpack. It's limitless. So, anyways, thanks for watching and uh, have a great day, guys. And I'll uh, talk to you later. Until next time. Alright, bye-bye.